hey, this is Josie. Put together a quick little video for you of six tips on how to set goals. Okay? It's going to be a quick little video. Step one. Now, where I'm getting this information from, if you haven't read the book Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill, get it. Um, I actually have a copy here from the library uh, that has a couple more of his books. So, uh, just in the first chapter, it talks about desire. Um, your desire to attain a certain goal and how you can accomplish that goal if you can basically uh, think that you're going to accomplish the goal that no matter what you do you're going to accomplish it uh, there's no plan B no plan C you're gonna do it and that's it kind of thing so the six steps are outlined in the first um, first chapter so you can you know go ahead and look at it if you like you want to follow along step number one Whatever your goal is, they talk about money, so I'm going to say everything in money, and, but you substitute whatever your goal is for, for money in this one, okay? Um, so step one is take whatever it is that you want to attain and be very specific about what it is. So if you want to attain, if you want to earn a certain amount of money, how much money? Okay, I'm going to give you an example of mine. I want to earn 15K. I have a very specific goal and I'll, you know, add on to that in just a minute. Step two, what are you going to give back in order to attain the money that you want to earn or to attain the goal that you want to earn? Everybody that's, that's ever moved from the lower rungs to the higher rungs in any kind of organization or, or with their goal, they've had to do things to give back. Uh, for example, Mike Hobbs in our prosperity team is really great about giving um, videos, added content for free. Um, he challenged us to put together this 24 video um, format. Um, it was a really big challenge and he said for those that complete the challenge I'll give you this uh, free webinar. So f I was absolutely amazed for three and a half hours last Saturday I sat and listened to this man outline every single little step I needed to take extremely detailed um, on, on how to put these videos together for our clients. So that is an example of someone who's a six-figure income earner giving something back. He has decided that he enjoys teaching, that he enjoys training, so that's what he's going to do to give back to his team, because if his team is successful, he will be successful. So he is giving back something to attain his goals. Okay. Um, step number three, give a precise timetable on when you want to accomplish that goal. Okay. So for me, I want to earn 15K in the next three months. And number four, uh, set up a plan, put together a very de detailed, I guess you'd say, project plan on how you're going to accomplish this goal. Include in it the specific amount of money you want to earn, the precise you know, timetable that you want to earn it within, what you're going to do to accomplish that goal. Okay, that's step three. Step four. I'm sorry, that was step four. Step five, you want to write it down. Uh, there's a statistic out there that 92% of people that have a goal do not write it down and therefore they do not attain it. That's a huge deal. So if you want to be the, one of the last 7 to 10% that actually attain the goals that they have for themselves, then write it down. When you write it down, you can write it down as a mission statement. You can write it down, uh, you know, as a, as a business type format or more of a personal type format. But write down specifically what it is you want to attain, what time. Be very, 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 very specific. Okay. So write it down. Write it in a statement and post it. Post it everywhere. Uh, you know, I don't care. Post it on the fridge. Post it near your desk. Post it next to your nightstand. Post it everywhere. Okay. Um, next thing that you need to do twice a day, okay, it is you need to read that mission statement, whatever you want to call that statement, my statement, my goals, my why, whatever you want to call it, I want you to read it twice a day. You're going to read it before you go to bed at night, and you're going to read it when you get up in the morning, okay? When you read it, you need to visualize yourself already having attained it. You need to see it visually, you need to feel it, heck, you need to smell it, I don't care what it is you need to do. Use the, all those five senses to believe that you have already attained that goal. Because if you visualize yourself 
as a successful person. You're going to act like a successful person. You're going to talk like a successful person. You're going to smell like a successful person. Okay, so I want you to take those six steps and let me know how it uh, how it went for you. I I've always had a tough time goal setting. I'm a little ADD, and one of the things that I've had to do is a system just like a, this. These six steps to help me keep focused on what my short-term and long-term goals are, okay? So I hope that helped you today. Uh, definitely read, think, and grow rich. Um, I, uh, I'm pretty fascinated by it, and I've only, uh, I think I've managed to get to chapter number two right now. So take care. See ya.